uploading. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Esther back with Coach's Feud. Let me present to you Rebecca and Taylor. Woo! Okay. Here we are again. If you guys Ready to go remember, down. <laughs> if you guys remember, like, not gonna be like that. <laughs> if you guys remember, Taylor won by a landslide. Whatever. Let's see if Rebecca can redeem herself today. So. No Name way. something it might take a 100-year-old man to do for 30 minutes. Um, well, he would have a hard time curling like me. Wow. Get some curls. <laughs> well, what is another answer? It would take him like 30 minutes to walk across the street. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. So, so rude. Jacob got the second best in what? So Rebecca got the second best answer. Like what? What's my name? The first answer was going to the bathroom. Good 30 job. minutes? What? Dang. If someone has to go doo doo and they're 100 years old, mm. that Takes might a take bit a while. Time. Really? Really? Time. Question number two mm. Name something people squeeze. Lemons. Wild Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> my heart. Anyway. <laughs> So Rebecca's on a roll because she got the second you come question out of nowhere? correct. Where are you at, girl? <laughs> okay. Here we go. Coming back. Let's go. Let's do another Stupid one. Questions. Okay. Who? One moment, please. I have a phone call. <laughs> Hold on. Hello? Yes. Um, okay. Name something men and dogs have in common. They're both the alphas. <laughs> what? What did you say? The alphas. The alphas? Mm -hmm. And dogs? Mm. They they run around. <laughs> so um the correct answer was they eat a lot. So wow. you guys got Leave that. This? Yeah, wow. that was men in my life. Sorry okay. Now you have five seconds to answer this. Okay, and I will count it down with my fingers. Okay, let's hear it. In five seconds, name an animal that starts with M. Go. Five. Monkey. Three. Mariachi. Two. I, I, um, one. Ooh, Rebecca for the win. Wow. Taylor. Rebecca, I'm so used to winning. Taylor, did you? Today I don't have it. And that was okay? the first and greatest answer. Ooh. So good job. Thank you. Good job, That's Rebecca. What were other answers? Could you tell me, please? That's for me to know and for you to find out. Okay. okay. So sorry, but I'm not. Come on, sorry. come on, let's do this. Okay, are you guys ready for the second this finale. answer? Daily double, let's go. Okay. Um, when a woman is trying to catch a man, name something she pretends to like. Go. His smile. Wow. His teeth. <laughs> well, you guys are both wrong because it's sports. The correct answer what? was oh, women try and wanna... pretend to like That's sports. That's not all what I pretend to like. Time when I was with that hockey team, I showed them a lot that I love their sports. <laughs> okay, well, you're a little... Hmm. Okay, wow. name a foreign country people vacation in where it'd be easy to pack on 10 pounds. Go. Germany. I name a country? Yes. America. You guys are both wrong. It's foreign? Oh, foreign. hello. <laughs> Here we go. This is where we Sometimes, tap into that. Brilliant. It's foreign to me. I'm not from here. Sometimes Rebecca really what? shows us her intelligence. It was the correct answer was Italy. So you guys. Oh, the pasta. The pasta. Mm -hmm. Pasta. I've been to macarons. I've been with the Italian. Macaroons. Macarons. Well, <laughs> is, is that Italian? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, they are. Macaronis. Okay. When you are feeling tense, ladies. Name yes. something that loosens you up. <laughs> what I've got some it? toys. <laughs> Loosen it. Uh. Okay, Rebecca. A big glass of red wine. Mm -hmm. So Rebecca wins. Oh, Rebecca. I'm not trashy like you. These people aren't being honest when they answer. They're just going with like safe ones. Honestly, I'm starting to think Rebecca is the smartest person alive. Oh, wow. Name a place your boss might move your desk to if he really, really hated you. Go. Corner office, no windows. Mm -hmm. I've been there. <laughs> so specific. If he hated you, you say? 
I would say next to like the stinkiest, ugliest person. Like the bathroom? <laughs> yeah. It's actually the basement. Yeah, the mail wow. room. So, I've excuse done me, in the basement. your hair is falling out on me, so let's it's keep It's not that hair, out. it's dirt, because you've been rolling around. Girl, this was shipped from France. I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> so, I went around and asked 100 women, married women, name something you wish your husband wasn't so comfortable doing around you. Farting. <laughs> Burping. Correct answer was Farting. Gosh. Taylor, you have one Taylor. point. Rebecca has about 50. So we're like done now. So we have one more question. <gasps> and this is the double family feud. Either way he loses. So. And if Taylor gets this right, I he win wins. everything. She wins this is the game. Clutch. How? You know what that is? <laughs> clutch. And this, if, is where I, if you, this is where I shine. <laughs> And if you get this answer right, Taylor, you lose the whole game. If I get it right? You lose the whole game. Clutch. Let's, let's go. Yeah, All Becca. right. Let's go. Let's go, okay. Becky. Name something you'd need if you were opening up a funeral home. Caskets. <laughs> Money. You guys are both wrong, so we're going to do that again. It was actually dead bodies. We need so. those. You got to put them in somewhere. You don't have to get the number one. Um, more than... You have to get the number one on my show. So Taylor, you don't make the rules, girl. Yeah, Just I make strike. the rules. This is my show. So, okay. <laughs> one second. I just really want to make sure. Okay. Wow. Name something you'd keep in your desk if you were having an office romance. The rubber. <laughs> <laughs> Love letters. What the? Taylor got the answer correct, so she loses the whole game. Wait, Taylor got Rebecca it correct. Lost. Rebecca lost. Got the answer Becca correct, lost. so she Taylor loses wins. the whole game, and Taylor it. won. So this is a game for losers, apparently. <laughs> Taylor won the whole game, so Rebecca. Like usual. Rebecca, going better on luck a next champion. time with you and your rubbers. <laughs> Bye, guys. Piss. <laughs> That was hilarious. It's me and Jacob. We're gonna show you the workout and talk about the warm up and the strength and the workout. It's a 15 minute AMRAP, so let's get going. Hello. All right, everybody. I know we wanted Esther to continue singing, but let's go ahead and get ready for these workouts. We're on week seven, day two, okay? So now, since we lended out a few barbells to some people, we're going to do some barbell workouts this week, and we're also going to demonstrate the movements and stuff like that as simple as we can for you guys, okay? So for the warm-up, for the barbell warm-up specifically, we're going to start with 10 singles, okay? This is all going to be a five-minute AMRAP. 10 singles, okay? Once you go with those, let's put the rope down. Let's go ahead and approach those barbells. I know it's been a long time, you guys, so S will demonstrate perfectly for y'all. Okay, make sure you pick up the barbell with a nice flat back. Clean or deadlift style grip. We're gonna go one barbell shrug, just like that, shrugging the shoulders, one barbell high pull. Good. Into one barbell muscle clean, so no dip underneath. Elbows shoot through. Into that front squat with the barbell. Good. Then she's gonna put the barbell down. Then we're gonna double the reps, okay? For the singles. We're gonna go 20 singles. Okay? Or jumping jacks if you don't have your rope. Okay? Then we're gonna do two of those movements, okay? So it'll be the two barbell shrug. Oops. Sorry. Shrug, there we go. It's been a long time, you guys. Uh, <laughs> barbell uh, high pull now. Good. And two muscle cleans. Perfect. And two front squats, okay? Good job, we're gonna keep that rep scheme. Next you'll do a shoot with your 30 and three, 40 and four, okay? So, for the dumbbell warm up, for you guys that have dumbbells, okay? We're gonna go start with singles again or jumping jacks, 10 and 10, okay? Into single dumbbell high pulls, okay? Good, into an air squat. Good, into your jump rope again. If you feel like the high pulls and the squats too easy, speed up your reps, okay? Kinda make it like a short little five minute workout for you guys, okay? So it's gonna be two and two again. So two high pull with both arms, remember it's single, okay? Into one air squat, two air squats, sorry. Good, and that's gonna be your dumbbell one, okay? Odd objects, 
We have a backpack and Enviro side. Um, today it does herpes, simplex, virus types one and two. So if you ever come in contact with that, this will eliminate that for you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so same rep scheme, okay? It's gonna be those ten singles or ten jumping jacks. Okay, into one inchworm to push up. Go ahead, so crawl out, like straight, push up. Good. If you have to drop to your knees on those push ups, you can drop to your knees as well. Just like that, okay? Just make sure that chest touches the ground. Into one odd object deadlift. Just like that, keeping the back nice and flat, okay? You should feel it in the hammies. Into one air squat. Very good. Then, as you remember from the past two, it's going to be 20 singles or 20 jumping jacks. Okay? Into two inchworm to push ups. Okay, remember this is a five minute AMR, so set your clock for five minutes. Into two of the deadlifts. Very nice. Into two air squats. Okay? And that is going to be your warm up for each specific uh, piece of equipment that you have at home. Okay? So, let's go ahead and start with the strength piece. This is a really good strength piece today. I like this one a lot. We're going to start on the ground, okay? We're going to straight with the barbell first. We're going to go 20 seconds, okay? Max floor press. Okay, it's basically a bench press, but on the floor. Okay, you can have your legs straight or you can have them up, whichever you like. Just make sure those triceps and elbows touch the ground. Fully lock it out on the top. Okay, you're going to get max reps here, okay? It's going to be a really quick burn. Good, 20 seconds of that, then 20 seconds of hold at the top, okay? Keep those arms locked out. Look how focused she is on that barbell. Beautiful. Okay, then you're going to put that barbell down, okay? You're going to be quick about it, and you're going to do 20 max push-ups, okay? As many as you can get. Oh. Good, wow. <laughs> that right. one's 30. <laughs> All right, you're going to do three rounds of that for that barbell, okay? And if you have the weights on there on the sides, it's a lot easier just to slide around that barbell. So let's go ahead to the dumbbells now. Same thing, max floor press. Okay, very good. Notice the angle of her arms. Good. 20 seconds max there. Then 20 second hold at the top. Arms locked out again. Very nice. You'll put the dumbbells down. Last 20 seconds here, you'll do your max push ups again. Okay, this is going to be a tricep burner, you guys. All right, good. Three rounds of that, all right? Now, if you have an odd object for your strength, floor press again, okay? Same thing, just pressing up, down, trying to get those elbows to the ground as far as you can. Very good. Holding it at the top for the second 20 seconds. Then putting the odd object down and 20 seconds of your max push-ups. Very good. If you have to drop to those knees, remember you guys always drop to your knees if you have to. Okay? And that's going to be our strength piece. It's pretty cool that you can pick any piece of equipment and do this strength. Okay? Alright, so for this workout, it's a 15 minute AMRAP. It's a pretty long workout. So let's go ahead. We'll demo with the barbell. Okay? So it's going to start with one hang squat clean. So for a squat clean, there you go. The warm up piece should warm you up for this. It's a big shrug, pull, squat underneath the barbell into one thruster. Just like that, okay? It's a squat with a push press, barbell down. Now, if you have a rope, you're going to come to your rope. You're going to do 30 double unders. Okay, or 60 singles, okay? So it's normal singles or 40 jumping jacks if you don't have the rope available to you, okay? Then the reps go up by one. Okay, so then it'll be two hang squat clean. Okay, two, nice. Very good. And the two thrusters. Good. Keep those knees out on those, okay? And then your double under, singles, jumping jacks, reps stay the exact same the whole time. The only thing that goes up by one rep is the barbell movement, okay? So let's move on to the dumbbell. It's the exact same thing. Slightly different because you have single arm movements. Okay, so it's going to be that hang squat clean. Good, bringing those dumbbells to the front rack into one thruster, lock now. Good. To your rope, doing your 30 double unders, 60 singles, or 40 jumping jacks. Okay, into two hang squat cleans again. Okay. 
Good. King squat. There we go. It's been a while. <laughs> Good. Into those thrusters. Okay. Remember that you go back to your rubber jumping jacks, then you'll add to three. Okay. Okay, now y'all, let's go ahead to the odd object workout now. Same movement, we're gonna demonstrate what a hang squat clean, clean looks like with an odd object. Just like that, watch out for those straps, they will hit you in the face, into a thruster. Okay, there you go. The balance of the odd object, you kinda gotta be more aware of that, because if you have weights or water balls inside, they'll kinda lean back. Into your 30 double unders, 60 singles for those 40 jumping jacks. Picking it back up. Now we're going two. Okay, everybody remember two. Hang squat clean into two thruster. Very nice. Into the 30 dubs, single, 60 singles for those 40 jumping jacks. Okay, and that's going to be your workout for today. Remember, it's 15 minute AMRAP. Okay, go ahead and put in those scores in Sugar Wad. Okay, comment on some people, give them some fist bumps. Also, some social distancing fist bumps. Social distancing. Because <laughs> it's virtual. Have fun, guys. Crush this workout.